how to find a woman in the Philippines. The best thing to find a woman in the Philippines is through the Facebook. You can have a Tinder or you can use those dating sites. But you gotta make sure that you have like the best pictures. Don't go there like with some random photographs taken with your phone like that. Make sure you have like the best pictures because you have to be presentable. It, it, makes, it, it makes a very big difference. Do you wanna be the one who is texting other women or you want to be the one that the woman will text you? So make sure you make sure you will wear like a very nice clothes. Thank you. Or try to look rich, you know. Try to look like you have lots of money. I know it's a little bit weird. Because if you are the real one, then you know like I don't need to fake it, like I know who I am. But you know the world is very fake. So you gotta you gotta play the game. And if you will play the game and you are the real one, you will win. So you know what do you think? What is the best place to find uh, for the guys? What's the best place to find the woman? Well, now it's the dating dating site is famous. So yeah, dating site Facebook. Usually Facebook. Hmm. There's a lot of different dating sites. On Facebook, you just add woman. Yeah. Just add it's woman to the your friend friends friend friends list. Just add woman woman woman, and the other woman from those women. They will see that you are on 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 their friend list, and the woman will start adding you. So it's gonna be like a like a snowball effect. Guys, look at this w weird fruit. Look at this. Jolina, show how they open it. You just twist this. Look at this. It's like a like a grenade. Yeah, just get that one and you squeeze it like that. And it boom. Look at this. It's sour. It's very sour. <laughs> look at this. Mm. They have a very big seed inside, but it's sweet and sour at the same time. Mm -hmm. And you really need that C vitamin here in the Philippines, because when you get like lots of sun, sun, the sun will suck out your C vitamin. So if you don't have, if you don't eat those fruits. You will have like lots of skin problems. So make sure you eat lots of fruit here. Damn, look at this fruit. It's so weird. It's like grenades, like a bomb. Yeah, then, the is so sour. <laughs> yeah, it is very sour. So the second subject, subject is how can you find yourself apartment? So the best place to find the apartment is actually a Facebook marketplace. It's maybe it's not the best, but it's the most convenient. You just go to the Facebook marketplace, choose a location, for example, Tumagetta. And in the search, you just put apartments for rent and you have lots of apartments there available. And you will just contact those people and you will see you just contact those people and meet, meet, and they will come and show you the apartment. Usually, they want to have like a one-year contract, contract, and a one month deposit and one month, one month rent ahead. So, did you got your hand? Wow. But if some some people, some owners they want to have like two month deposit, like don't accept that. It's a little bit sketchy. 
And actually that one year contract is, I don't know, we just try to speak that on a six month. It is possible, it's, it's just, we just need to speak. Did you cut your finger? Look at this, like a needle. Oh wow, it is. Like a spike. I'll open it now. What is that? Dragon food. Dragon food? Yeah, dragon food. Look at this. Um, I never even tasted dragon food. Really? You never tried that? No. Yeah. I'm gonna open it. Just a bit like that. So about like uh, transportation, like a scooter, like you have two options. You can rent and you can buy it for yourself. For example, if you want to buy the NMAX, NMAX will cost 150,000 pesos. You will drive with the NMAX one year and you can sell the NMAX for 100,000 pesos. So basically, if you do that, then the rent, you know, the rent will become like much cheaper. It's like a lipstick. Really? Uh-huh. Can I try it? Yeah, I need to, I need to open it. Yeah. Is it? No, I don't, I don't taste anything. <laughs> Is it like a watermelon? Yeah, it's like a watermelon, <laughs> but like no sugar. Yeah. I was expecting it was going to be like a strawberry or something. But yeah, you have two options to buy it or rent it. I recommend you guys to buy it because yeah, if you know you will stay here for a year at least, then it's okay. Just buy the scooter from the store and later you can, you can sell this. And for example, if you buy a scooter or example for example if you will rent a scooter you will pay like 10,000 pesos a month as a minimum so imagine you will be here where for 12 months you will end up paying 120,000 pesos just for the rent but if you will buy a scooter for example at NMAX for 150,000 pesos you can sell the NMAX for 100,000 at the end of the year and you will basically you will pay you will lose only 50,000 so it is much cheaper to buy the scooter for yourself and you will yeah yeah a driving so drive driving license like if you don't have a driver, driver's license, motorcycle driver's driver's license, you don't have to worry about because there is no police like that. There are sometimes on the road they have these checkpoints, but if you drive carefully, you will see ahead those checkpoints, and you just stop before the checkpoints. You see lots of people are stopping there also, and you will just wait like 30 minutes until they will open the checkpoint, and you can just keep going. So it's not a very big issue but it's much better to have the motorcycle license here so you don't have to worry about that especially when you're like traveling yeah you you just want to you just want to enjoy the ride not worry about the LTO here and if you already have a driver's license you can drive with your driver's license here in the Philippines 6 months it's not 3 months anymore it's 6 months now and you can only transfer your foreigner license to Philippines after six months. You cannot do that earlier. So it's only possible for after six months. So about the friends in the Philippines, do you have lots of foreigners here? Well, in Tumaguete you have lots of foreigners. Can you make friends with them? Yes, you can make friends, but you gotta keep that in mind, like most people here are like very alcoholic. You, you will have like lots of drinking buddies here if you want to. And with that drinking buddies, I'm sure you will have lots of drama also with them because when you guys sitting in the bar, 
somebody will meet the, like a woman, everybody will get jealous. Or if you will be the one who will bring the woman over there, everybody will get jealous. So what I want to say is that you have lots of drinking buddies, but it's really hard to find like, uh, like good people that they have something going on. You know, who's not just going out to the drink all the time and take you to the bad way. It's hard to find that. I don't have any good friends here in the Philippines. I've been here like two years. But I, I, I can have like lots of drinking buddies if I want to. But I don't want to hang around with those people. Yeah, I want to do better things than just drinking alcohol that much. So about the local people. <coughs> local people, they are very friendly, but they are very jealous. Especially the, uh, the guys here, then they are very jealous, very jealous. They will hate you. They will smile to your face, but deep down in their heart, they will, they will hate you so bad. Also with the woman also. Yeah. Like, if you will find yourself a girlfriend, and your girlfriend has like a friends, right? And you will make that girlfriend life very nice, and she will be very happy. Then her friends, they will be so, so jealous. They, wanna, they will do anything to ruin your relationship. What do you think? True. True, yeah. So people are very jealous. So imagine guys, I was trying with uh, I was trying with a very nice motorbike here before and I did the oil change and I saw in my oil I had like a small piece of, of rocks. Can you imagine that? Like some guy just got so jealous and put the rocks inside of my engine then that's so crazy, yeah. But they don't show you this. They don't show you that jealousy. They don't show you. They just smile to your face. But yeah. in in your back, them they will just say so much shit, so much shit. I don't like locals here at all, actually, especially the guys. You know, I just don't like them. Yeah, they get jealous of Fanny because look at Fanny, what Fanny is, and they don't have girlfriend. Yeah, just look at us mm -hmm. with our white skin. Mm -hmm. We got money. And good looking. Yeah, we just come here, we got big boom, mm -hmm. you know. Of course, imagine what those local guys are feeling. Yeah, imagine it's a big that. Com competition for them. Yeah, very big. Imagine yourself like you are in the in America or wherever club, you know. Everybody else is like complete white on a winter time. And there's gonna be like a brown guy comes in with the big muscles, with the gold chain, with a you know, nice haircut how you will feel and all the girls will be like mm -hmm. oh, how you will feel you will start hating that guy right away so but when you are a white guy and you will come here then those guys will they will look at you like the same way so there's lots of hate here and lots of jealousy and you got to be careful with that actually it can end up very bad you know if some men will get so jealous you know for example i don't know i saw videos Lots of foreigners have been killed because of that. Yeah, you gotta be careful with that. Just I don't look what foreigner have. Yeah. Foreigner can provide a woman. <laughs> Filipino cannot provide a woman. <laughs> yeah. But they With are friendly. Place. Yeah, they are. They are very friendly. But you are, if, for example, if you have a business, right, you are friendly with your customers also, right? So, yoga people, do you think they will, they are friendly because they expect something to receive, you know? Some they are, yeah, some. Did it all. Yeah, and if you go out with the locals, just know you are you are paying. Yeah. You are paying. <laughs> Very true. But there's no money there. They don't have money. They don't even money to buy yeah, cigarettes if you're a foreigner, or alcohol. Yeah. yeah. We expect you to pay everything. Yeah, you will pay everything, and yeah, 
you will have like 10 people with you and you will just pay for everything mm, that mango is so nice fruits here are just amazing you can just drive around and pick up pineapples beside of the road mm -hmm. damn it's so nice pineapples bananas coconuts everything is just available but one thing the vegetables doesn't grow here because it's just too hot you know the plants are getting the stress i tried to grow the vegetables like tomatoes cucumber pickles pickles and cucumber i think they're the same thing they, they just don't grow like yeah they don't grow the plants are under stress all the time because of the heat but if you live like in the mountain for example where are we right now you guys see the, yeah here you can grow here you can grow and is it easy to find the woman here is it easy to get the woman here yeah it is very easy if you follow my follow my footstep what i just told you that's for the, today's video you guys you know what's gonna be in head you guys know so i'm preparing for that so yeah as always guys thank you so much for watching and if you like these videos and you want to see more of these videos i will put the payment link under the video description send us kvarta so we can just go travel around and visit more places so and as, as always guys thank you thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos bye 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 yeah.